Okay. Let's see. We'll uh, we'll see if this video will post. I don't know if it'll post on this page or not, but we'll give it a try. So yeah, I, I see all the people talking about my hometown of Fort Dodge. Just wanted to chime in a little bit. Yeah, I grew up in Clare, and uh, about 13 miles away, and. Uh, yeah, I went through the Catholic school system, went through St. Edmund there, uh, Iowa Central Community College, worked in radio for, uh, I got my start in radio there, worked with Jane Morgan and Mike Libby and Dave Halden and all those guys. And uh, Jane's still there, Dwayne Murley, all those great people, big shout out to the broadcasting department there uh, in Fort Dodge. But yeah, it, you know, I see on there people talking about how horrible it is and it's all drugs, you know. That's all it is. It's got to be just drugs. Well, except for the people I mentioned on the radio, they're still there. Um, they're not on drugs. But that's it. The rest, everybody else is on drugs. Um, there's nothing but crime, just really bad people there. That's it. Well, except my brother and my sister in law and some nieces and nephews that still live around there um let's see and some yeah there's some family that are still there but yeah other than that my family and the people at the radio stations you know they're not on drugs but that's it everybody else is on drugs um well wait a minute now there's i had some friends from college that are still there my buddy Travis lives there. He's he's he delivers the mail there. We went to school together. He's pretty cool. He met his uh, his wife there. She's a sweetheart, and you know they, you know, have a, raised a family there. Other than that, let's see my family, the people at the radio station. Other than them, they're all in, everybody else is on drugs. Well, wait a minute now. There, there might be some business owners that are still there. I worked with and you know, being in radio with advertisers and stuff that still own some good businesses there in town. Um, they're not on drugs. Um, they haven't stolen any cars or anything or beat anybody up that I'm aware of. Other than that, everybody else is violent. There's just it's a horrible town. Other than those people I mentioned. Well, and then there's all the people that. Went to church at Corpus Christi and Sacred Heart and Holy Rosary, um, you know, the Trinity there. Um, there's still, I think there's still some pretty good people that go to churches there in, in, the, in my community there. They're okay, but everybody else is on drugs. And there's, well, there's some people in the Lutheran faith. I know some people there and some Baptists. There's some good church communities there. Those people, as far as I know, are really good people, though. But other than that, um, everybody else is on drugs. Uh, and everybody else is, you know, vic uh, violent crimes and all that stuff. Um, but, uh, yeah, other than maybe, you know, 15, 20,000 people, I think... big of a town uh, you know so if there's 20 to 25,000 good people there's maybe maybe another thousand people left something like that anyway I found it all pretty interesting uh, you guys have a wonderful week and uh, I am too in Battle Creek Michigan here and I'm gonna go deliver some more Grubhub and all that kind of stuff here and kind of finish my day there's some areas of town though around here I really need to stay out of because Battle Creek can be pretty, pretty rough sometimes. All right, have a good night.